But at the same time, you can't really afford to, to go into panic mode in a game like this. This is... This is going to be so difficult. It's going to be so difficult for them to claw, claw their way back in if they give this up right now. So um, I'm having a bit of problem here, a dog problem actually. They're 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 invading me, but right now, uh, yeah, 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 uh, yeah. They they are they are invading me, <laughs> but yeah, this is uh, going to be Jester, uh, half dog, and. Uh, you know, uh, Chester and the others with the Grok, they're just uh, gonna control the map. And that's that, that's the that's the main thing that they're gonna uh, try to do, actually. So, what happened there? What, uh, what we lost happened? The we lost the draft? Yeah. We lost the draft? We'll, we'll talk about that in a bit. I think we just need to get the, get the draft here. Because I'm very curious about the last two picks that's gonna come here for NXP. They are going to close this out very very soon with probably yeah there you go i was thinking about the masha but it didn't get the words out soon enough we can still roger here probably and they would be failed but they might be thinking about something else so let's give it up to team chick how do you close this out will you be able to deal with the roger if they decide to pick it and are you gonna pick heroes that will stop the rampage of nxp here because this is your chance to do it. Okay. Uh, Kisetsu will go for the. Uh, I don't know. It's a really good pick. We're not seeing. Uh, we're not seeing Kax anymore. Uh, we're actually seeing uh, Kisetsu here. And Yaoi is hovering this Layla. Uh, <laughs> I'm. I'm pretty sure it's not the pick that they're gonna go for. Rene J has the Masha, so he's really happy with that. I feel that Yaoi as well was planning on to go for the Brute. There you go. I mean, it's not super uh, It's not super popular as a pick these days, but that just means NXP Solid is super comfortable with picking out picks that are not super meta. And uh, those to show, maybe this might be a small opening here for Team Chick. Maybe. If they can catch Yaoi, uh, I'm actually a, a little surprised that Yaoi isn't on tank mode right now. So that means the multi roll is real. So I'm I'm just running out of uh, I'm just running out of like uh, easy pickings here for NXP to just crit their way into victory here with H2O's Bruno. Yeah, Kizetsu and the others, they're just uh, really just uh, trying to force out a lot of these uh, fights. But NXP Solid, they just have this a certain amount of uh, pressure that they can get from Team Chase. Just because Chang'o is still Chang'o. And once Chang'o has the ultimate, they have to back out. Yep. Chang'o still is going to be a, a respectable amount of damage output, especially in the early game. You cannot, uh, you cannot really deal with... Uh, Unless you have like a, a good solid front line, and they do have a good solid front line in Yaoi, but the rest of this is going to be a question mark here for me. Like aside for Chang, uh, everyone else is just receiving a beating as well. Rene J and Chester just going on the bot lane. They removed that Valir, and where else? Who else is gonna fight? I feel. Look at look at the map, bro. Team Chick, they. Just reacting to everything that NXP Solid is doing. Literally just, I'm gonna farm and then if they come near, I'll attack them. That's what's happening right now. And is that really the way you want to do against NXP? Mm, it is probably, but you know what? NXP Solid, even if they had a bit of a hiccup into the early game, they're still getting what they want. Team Chick cannot answer. They cannot answer with anything here. Because Hot Dog is trying his best to push them back, but... You know, H2O is just gonna kick the lights out of them. Yep, H2O definitely just gonna go start kicking. And I wanna see that one hit thing, the one hit crit for Bruno. Maybe we'll see that later on. Maybe if he finds the hell crit in a weird spot. Because I think that's what they're trying to go for here. Finally, by the way, they will get some control of their buff, but they give it away almost instantly. What the heck is up here with NXP? They are playing like they have they know everything that Ch Team Chick is doing at every single moment. 
Mm-hmm. And uh, Pabu, going 1v1 in the MB, this is going to be a lane where as long as MB doesn't go to the near the turret and he doesn't get thrown back to the turret, he's not gonna go down. I'm pretty sure he's not gonna go down anytime soon. Pabu just trying to control the wave, just trying to con- protect the, the, the turrets. And uh, NXP solid. He's gonna go to the top lane. Kizetsu here will be the casualty. He will get caught out. Okay, so everyone on the uh, on the voice comms are saying, "What do we do? What do we do?" <laughs> Redeem chick. They're looking and they're waving and they are going hard. NXP solid takes the tower on top lane very very easily. Itemization looking very solid as well. For these guys, all, almost all of them completing the Raptor's machete and doing some pretty solid physical penetration damage on towers and on minions. So it's just so difficult to duel with them right now. Uh, there is no way that you're going to win the straight out duel here with NXP Solve. You need to be creative. Mm hmm. NXP Solid, you, you just have to uh, see how. How well are they trying to, um, you know, just trying to se- separate themselves? Because they know that in terms of team fight, Team Chicks has a bit of an advantage here. I mean, a bit, because they have the Atlas and the setup is still there. If they get three stacks, or uh, let's say if they get like the Fatal Licks and three stacks on the Valor, that's enough time for every single one on the side of Team Chick to be as much as possible sent getting hit by that ball. And it kept on bouncing, and it that arrow will actually hit Valor hot dog here. He disappeared. We'll be trying to get away, but MB really just wants to fight, and Chang'o will get caught out. Oh, he almost died. He almost stepped on that abyssal trap. If he did, that could have been a death. But Team Chick, with the presence of my Renegade, will go down to the bottom lane. Yeah, I feel like it's just a. Uh... It's just Team Chick trying to stay alive. I feel like if they stay alive, in the mind of Team Chick, if we stay alive after an engagement, we're we already their job. But that absolutely will not be enough because right now, 5,000 gold lead here separating these two teams, and they are roaring for more. Looking at the stat line and looking at the amount of itemization that they had earlier, Team Chick is definitely falling behind very, very quickly. Not to mention that NXP Solid has full control of their map as well. Okay, so Team Chick, they actually mending something here. They they actually made something happen about the aggression that's gonna that was coming out from NXP Solid. Well, uh, you just have to uh, realize that NXP Solid, in a way, is just they're stopping in terms of aggression and this is the first step to you know uh win against nxp solid is to make them uh how do you say this to make them uh know or to pressure them not to do what they're used doing take them out of them take them out of their element i think that's the right term yeah because nxp is very is a very aggressive team we've seen uh four games Almost four. We, we we didn't see four games, actually. Now it's gonna be the we see yeah. all four games. We saw four games of them, and they were very aggressive all throughout. Each and every game, they want to go in. They want to go hard. They take down tanks like there's no tomorrow as well. That's gonna be basically an unstoppable push here. Even hot dog on that Valier absorbs the abyssal trap. Doesn't even get dove in because you know what? NXP Solid, they know what they want. They want those turrets and they get them without any resistance. Uh huh. Bottom lane is the next target here for the side of Team uh, for NXP Solid. And uh, Team Chick, they are they're just hugging out the turrets. I think it's the pr- proper thing to do right now. You can't, you can't really have yourself, you know. Uh, you can't really have yourself getting caught by NXP Solid. Because if they do, I think Chester here would be really happy if you if they just go out of their uh, lanes. But if they don't... But there's a downside in not going out of your base. Chester's free reign over it. Chester can just spread out the Abyssal Arrows. And if he gets those Abyssal Arrows... Uh, if if they, he gets those Abyssal Traps, rather... 
I think Team Chick will step on it every single time, and NSP Solid will have an idea where they are. Yeah, basically just try to step up and uh, gain map control again. But again, the traps from Chester is just... It's just so difficult to scout as well. Even Jester, the Atlas, is already having a hard time just walking over, over bushes. Because he doesn't feel like a solid tank at this point, right? He is also super vulnerable to any of these hits, to any incoming abyssal arrows, to the sh the the burning, the molten sights here of MB that they are afraid to just walk on now. They're just happy with getting these uh, these small uh, scraps of gold coming in from the minions. Now the Lord will be taken here by NXP Solid. What's going to be the answer? <laughs> I don't know, we're running out here. Uh, uh, no, no. The answer is to just run away as far as fast as possible. Look at that. Yaoi with the play. And Jester here, he gets the fatal links off. Will he get away? That is the question. Almost getting hit by that abyssal arrow with that abyssal trap. Renegade really just trying to push as much as possible. And H2O and the others, they can, they're not really having their way. Just Looking at the other games where there is a high kill score for the side of NXP Solid, right now it's still at 9. 10 minutes into the game. Team Chick, they've been playing very carefully, Yep. but they didn't really get anything from being careful, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, they were a lot more careful compared to game 1, right? But did that actually... Does that... As I keep asking, does that actually mean anything to NXP Solid. Right now, it's H2O going nuts. On a killing spree here. Even their one of their tankiest heroes just disappeared here without any answer. Atlas with the Fatal Link only forces a flicker out of Chester and makes Yaoi walk out. Other than that, they are just scratching. Scratching the armor here of NXP. They're not really doing any any damage. Mm-hmm. That is one of the things that you really have to look out for, Rockheart. I do agree with you. H2O, look at the damage output that he's gonna do. He kicked the hell out of Jester earlier, and Jester was Jester was uh, at half HP in two hits. Yeah, basically so, the crits that we were crits, talking about earlier. Yeah, The crits and the possibilities. Yaoi here just being the bully that he is. They're not even putting him... They're not even putting any pressure on Yao. He's just using the power of nature to stay in there. He isn't even getting damaged or anything. Yeah, he isn't. He's just walking on and he's just absorbing everything and just enabling Renegade and H2O. At this point, they are just going to go straight for the base. No fear at all. That's going to be game. And NXP Solid 2 0 goes forward and waits at the finals. Wow, NXP solid, solid performance.